four mil, these niggas sound crazy. Going through some shit, can't let it get to me. Can't let it take all of my time and all my energy. Gotta watch some cash, you claim that they are fucking kidding me. Gotta watch your friends before they turn into your friend of me. Going through some shit, can't let it get to me. Can't let it take all of my time and all my energy. Gotta watch some cash, you claim that they are fucking kidding me. Gotta watch your friends before they turn into your friend of me. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the Hawaii Tech Sharks Dynasty here on NCAA 14. Week three, fresh off of a big win against Illinois last week. Uh, before we get into this week's matchup, we're going to check in here with some recruiting. You know, got some got some players that recording. We got all but three scholarships offered. One is to Rashad Green. One is to Scott Underwood. The other is to Gary Pope. Gary Pope, I'm really not sure if we want to offer him or not. Um, we don't want to have too many DNs, you know, because if we come down here. Oh, wow. Randy Yates is ready for a visit, too. So let's go ahead and schedule that thing for Air Force. We'll hold it down there. Boom. Got Air Force scheduled. Um, let me get out of schedules now. Forget where I'm at. Prospect overview. Go there now. Thank you. All right, so, you know, we're currently behind on Billy Spencer. Um, really not too worried about that because, you know, we're ahead on Avery Harris. Avery Harris just isn't that fast. 86 speed, 82 excel. We need speed at that position, bro. Like, we really do. We need an athlete that's going to be interested in coming to the program. But what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and fall back off of Billy Spencer. So, Spencer's gone. We'll go ahead and we'll, we'll add more points on to Avery Harris. Let him know that he's the running back that we want to go after. Randy Yates is coming in to visit. Kevin Owen, Owen's still in the lead. Gabriel Tober, we'll go ahead and add more on you because we, we need that offensive line help. Lawrence Harris, a center. We have our center. Our center is a senior now. So, excuse me, we'll go ahead and add 350 on him. Rashad Green, we're still in the lead. Adam McNeil, it's one of the DNs we want to bring in here. He's a priority DN. We offered him a scholarship. Scott Underwood, we are sitting pretty there. We'll get him up to 300. Allen Royal, you know, we're in a little battle with Utah State, but we should run away. We offered him as well. Gary Pope, we'll offer him a scholarly just to see what happens, to see if we'll overtake San Diego State. If not, you know, we'll probably just fall back. Ryan Gaines, this is somebody we've been trying to go after a lot, really hard. We offered him a scholarship last week. Uh, Adam Blankenship, we are way ahead a Fresno State there definitely liking that decision to go after him heavy Brandon Joseph ahead of BYU Bobby McNeil a middle linebacker we really want on the squad projecting to be really well I mean to be a really good player we'll go ahead and max him out to 500 Trey Wright we're sitting good Derek Abrams you know what I mean Arizona's trying to make a case Jonathan Williams I think it's safe to say we are not going to be uh getting him to come to the squad Juco free safety David Mason We'll get you up to three, 250. Michael Scott, we definitely need a running, you know, a cornerback or two to come and be able to step in and play, uh, you know what I'm saying, day one as soon as they step on to uh, campus. So we'll leave all of those guys at 250. Actually, who are we? Okay, we'll leave all those guys at 250 just because we're doing well. Let's see who else. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll max out Gary Pope, too, just because we're we're behind and we have the extra points. McNeil will max him out since San Diego State. I mean, McCall, excuse me, since San Diego State is on our heels. Rashad Green will offer you a scholarship. Let's see who else. Gabriel Tolbert will max you out since everybody's so close. And then we'll max out David Jones. Never thought I'd see the day when I recruit a fullback, but, you know, I, will, I want some depth there at the position. Now, you see here, first win, a close one. Warfield, Hawaii Tech manages to edge Illinois by a hair in season debut. That wasn't here earlier. You know what I mean? Last episode when we moved the week to see if they were going to talk about it. Well, maybe because I didn't go down to recruiting. But you know what I mean? Just a quick overview of the game. Great game, bro. We dominated um, time of possession. We scored with 544 left. Made a stop with about 517 left, and we never gave up the ball again. This week, we're taking on our rival, Hawaii, who will uh, surprisingly have a win this year. 
You know, they went almost over the they went over the first year and almost over the second year. But they're B minus B, B minus. We're D, D, D minus. They have us beaten everything except for turnover differential. But you know, we're negative one there. You know, our leaders Warfield had a good game. Madley scored a touchdown. Jason Harris led all receivers. Paisley leads us in tackles. LSR leads us in sacks. Hawaii's leader. Their quarterback threw for 200 yards. Their running back ran for 100, and their receiver ran for 139. Looks like they might might have a new coach. Last year, their offensive coordinator had them running the wing T triple option. So I'm I'm anxious to see what offense they come out with this season. You know, you know, we beat the Illini and they beat Iowa. Okay, so uh, you know, what I mean, there's nothing else left to be said, dog. I'll see you guys out there on the field. All right, boys, here we go. Aloha Stadium, beautiful day here in Paradise. You would think we would have more more of our fans that would travel here to come see us play or even some bandwagon fans here. I see it was sprinkled around all over the place, but we're going to put on a show for sure. All right, boys. So we lose the coin toss. Hawaii elects to defer. Here we are with the rock first. We got to set the tone offensively. Prevail on the return. He's been having good returns, you know. Warfield last game. We already went over his stats. All right, boys. So they're loud out here already at, at, at Aloha Stadium. Boom, over the middle. We got our man Mike Cutler. Let's get it. All right, just like that, we have shut the crowd up. Oh, Isaac's wide open. Broken play defensively. Getting the end zone. He's brought down inside the 10. Let's go. 50-yard reception to start off this ball game. All right, Isaac, one-on-one -on -one over there. Nope, a little bit of help. Just take off with your legs, Warfield. Can he get in the end zone? He's just short. Eight-yard rush. Now it's madly time. All right, second and goal here. We're going to go with a little bit of a, uh, you know what I mean, not a normal run play. We're going to hand it off to Isaac Johnson. He's in the end zone with his first rushing touchdown of his career, baby. Let's go. All right, first and 10. Oh, I forgot to set up my defensive settings. So they are not in the wing T offense. Let's see what they run out here. Ah, we leave somebody open in the flats. Make a tackle. All right, second and one. So, yeah, that, that coach definitely probably got fired because they only won, like, one game last year. Oh, good tackle. Oh my gosh, bro. Y'all got to make these tackles, fam. Luckily, Bauer makes a tackle there, but geez, oh man. We're going to blitz these dudes, bro. They want to run the ball crazy. Good tackle. There we go. That's what I want to see, man. In the backfield, Peter Dahl with a nice TFL. Empty backfield. Well, not an empty backfield set. They're in a bunch formation. Oh, best communication there between the quarterback and the wide receiver. All right. Third and 13. Time for us to get a stop here. Watch out for the screen. No screen. Everybody's just running straight. Oh, yeah. Make a play, Bauer. You oh, suck. my gosh. You're in no man's land out there, sir. The true freshman Bauer looking lost on a deep pass. I don't know where he was just he was just running free. You feel me? Quarterback's going to keep it. He does not. And Givens is in the end zone. And just like that, Hawaii ties this ball game up. Wide open over the middle is Jason Harris. Make some people miss. Ah, too many. Too many black jerseys coming at him. Warfield, four for four here in this game so far, baby. Washington, their star corner, their impact corner is injured right now for two quarters. It's good news for us. I see you. Oh, go, oh, Spratly. What a catch, baby. Let's go. That route took forever to develop, but what a dot, man. Audible out of our original play. Got one. Bang. Mike Cutler. Down at the five, 13 yard pickup. All right, boys, second and goal here. I guess I'll really be focused up. I used to play all my games in silence. Boom, toss to Madley. Can he get the blocks? He does not, but can he beat them in the end zone? Two yard pickup. All right, fellas, here we go. We're going to try our luck with Isaac Johnson again. Third and goal here. He's in motion. Boom. Oh, he is met at the line of scrimmage and hit hard. We're going, should we take the points? Should we go for it? All right, man. Scary money don't make money. We're on the road. You know what I'm saying? I like our chances if we don't get this stop here. I mean, if we don't score here to get a stop. Got one. Mike Cutler. Let's get it. One thing I'm trying to do more on, on defense is, is, is strafe. You know, sometimes I just, I'm just so quick to overcommit. It's a run for Vail, but we still miss the tackle even with the strafe. You know, I mean, my angles are just terrible sometimes, but sometimes they're on the money. First and 10 for Hawaii. They, aren't, they don't look like they're going anywhere anytime soon. Their offense is real. We just got to force a turnover or something. Quarterback's taking off. Come on, LSR. There we go, baby. Get the sack. Number two on the year. Way to walk over him, too. I like the intensity. Second and 10 after that stop. Look alive. Watch out for the screens. No screens. 
Oh, get that. Ooh, good defense. Come on, Bauer. Put your hands up, though, man. You might have a, you might have six. Givens, their running back is out for two quarters. So not only is their star running, their star quarter cornerback, their star quarter, I mean, uh, wide, uh, running back is out too. Dang, I can't talk. It's a run. Oh, I missed the tackle with LSR. Abernathy slows him down though. Good play, 54. Let's go, baby. We get time to make the throw. He gets a step. Yeah. When you throw it, oh my goodness, beautiful throw. I mean, he's a little underthrown. But when you throw it out instead of behind, he's almost always going to make the play. Warfield continues to have a perfect day out here. He's nine for nine. Let's go, man. Man, he needs a little bit more arm strength, and that might be six, dog. But give me that. Come on now. Stop playing with us, dog. 50-50 ball is his. A little bit bad at that. I thought we were still running the ball. I thought we were still passing the ball. There were so many openings. What? Yo, now they're just not calling the plays I'm telling them to call. This is crazy. Oh, Isaac beat his man off the line. Yes, sir. Oh, get inside. 30-yard pickup for, for Shuffle God. He continues to kill. Warfield's having a great day. We hand it off to Madley. Can he get some blocks? He does. Get in the end zone. Bang. Let's go. Jacob Madley getting in the end zone from very, very far out, man. We don't get a lot of far touchdown runs like that, but I will take that one. Immaculate blocking in that situation by the O-line and the receivers. All right, watch out for screens here. Oh, yes, sir. We taking everything away. Let's go, Sharks. I'm loving what we're seeing out here today, man. We are taking away first, second, and third options, fam. Third and 10. It's a screen. We took it. Oh, we overcommitted after we took it away. But we still make the tackle. Let's go. I didn't. I thought we were going to get the sack, so I kind of just kept coming down instead of sitting down. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, good D. Loving the game that the coordinator is calling out here today as well. Boom. Mike Cutler. Wheels, kid. Come on, 88. Come on, 88. Touchdown. Woohoo! This feels so good because whenever we beat up on Hawaii, this is, you know what I mean? As long as we beat them every single season, we are happy, dog. The offense is clicking on all cylinders, fam. That's a perfect tight spiral, too. So, you know, as long as we, luckily, we, we took the lead, so we can't, they can't run the ball on us forever. You know what I mean? Our run defense is terrible, usually. But if we're up 21, how long can they really run the ball? You know what I'm saying? Bef you know what I mean? As long as we keep a double-digit lead before they have to start airing it out. And that's where I feel like we'll be most effective as a defense. Oh, Victor kills us over the middle. This is the first team in any series on this channel where we don't create turnovers. And creating turnovers is what, is what I really thrive off of in this game. For Vail, you just either in the wrong place or just missing tackles. And Darren Hill is in the end zone. We had him stop two times. You know what I'm saying? Missed tackle by two by two defenders. It just can't happen. Who was that on the first missed tackle? It was Abernathy. Then for Vail, two true freshmen who we need to step up and be able to make big tackles. Four catches, 139 yards for Isaac. He's looking like how Cumbie looked, looked against us for the Illini last week. Little check down. Ah, oh, it's batted away. I seen you, Madley. We almost ran up out of there and didn't attempt it. 205 left here, second and 10. One safety high. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm taking advantage of that, or at least attempting to. One-on-one. -on -one, this should be criminal to play one-on-one -on -one against us, man. It should be criminal to play one-on-one -on -one against us, dog. Like, come on. Like, look at the tape. I see no safety high. I'm audible in that every single time. Wrong button. Whoa, I just hit the wrong. I had a brain fart. Wow, I can't believe he dropped. That's his second pick drop. But, yo, I was not, I was not trying to go there. I was... I completely panicked, bro, and just hit the wrong button. Oh, bro, bro, bro. That can't happen again, fam. Uh, get rid of it. We'll take our three points. We are lucky to come away with three here because we should have thrown a pick. Two picks on this drive already, so you know what I'm saying? I will gladly kick this, and we, we extend our lead back to 17, back to three scores. All right, boys, so we're going into the locker room up 14. Hawaii does receive the ball to start the second half. But we got to come out here and continue to stop them and then put points on the board. Give me that. Ah, oh, he dropped that shit hit triangle again. Uh, I read that one perfectly. I just I just took just took a little longer to get over there. All right, second and 10 here. It's a run. Nobody's there to make a play. Oh my gosh, how does that happen? Their best their best offensive threat is in the game. They're running back and we are struggling to stop him already. Wide open up the middle. 
Good tackle by Paisley. Ah, uh, Bauer getting killed again and also not making a tackle. And we give up six on the same play that Victor scored on him earlier with, man. Come on. You know, I'm not too mad. It is hard to stick with somebody across the field. You know what I mean? The, we got to get pressure up front, too. You know what I'm saying? So that's on the D-line as much as him. See the game track here. So far, we're having a great day throwing the ball. Shuffle God Johnson cannot be stopped. Their star corner is back in the game, though, so we'll see if he has an impact on the game against Isaac here. Take a look at his numbers. Five for 170. Still has yet to, to, to see the end zone, though. We try to go back to the well there with a play that has worked several times in this ball game. Nothing hurt. Nothing hurt with the try, though. Ah, just play taking forever to develop. Smart sack. So we're only one for three on third down conversions here today, and now the crowd is into it big time. We get a chance to roll out a little bit. Jason Harris breaking a tackle. Let's go. I mean, you are you guys, we, we only have so many plays we can call on third and 19. So, you know what I mean? Four versus it is. Just get open. Find a soft spot in these zones. Spratley. Oh, if you could have stayed in bounds. If you, oh, if you had the wide side of the field. That corner of theirs, man, his, pre, his presence is felt immediately with him being back in the game this quarter. As it should be. That's why he's an impact player. Oh, I should have just kept running and cut it up. But we're going for it. We're too close to punt. On the ball, fellas. You guys already know what time it is. Same same thing. Boom. I seen you, Cutler. I said if we just kept going straight, you know what I mean? Instead of just trying to spin, we would have been good. On the ball. We letting these dudes get too set, man. No huddle has been. It worked for us last week. You know what I'm saying? I can see it working for us again this week. See what Isaac can do against their impact player. Impact player versus impact player. He usually wins those battles. Oh, he's wide open. He easily won that one because he fell asleep. Let's go. Passing this off to your safety like we some bum. What you thought this was, fam? Woo, you already know. Shh, let him know, dog. Ain't nothing sweet out here, fam. You caught looking in the backfield thinking your safety going to get over there in time. No, sir. Try blitz, try man, try zone. It's like nothing gives us a, a, a good push up front. Go oh, put your hands up. Put your hands up, Paisley. It's a run. Oh, quarterback didn't keep it. I was heavy on him. Good tackle there by Delroy Vincent, the big 6'10 beast. It's a run. Can we make the tackle? Elisar does. Way to fill the gap and be the cleanup crew for your main man, Gary Abernathy. So I'm winding down here in the first, I mean the third. Now we'll run the ball. They want us to pass it. Boom, Madly, fall for it. That's all I can ask for, man. That's going to do it for us here in the third quarter as we pick up that five-yard rush with Jacob Madly. Get those fours up, ladies and gentlemen. We're up 14, heading into the final uh, period of play. Uh, we score here. We're in the driver's seat, and I like where we are. We're only two for five on third down conversions here today, fam. Like, that's not good. You know what I'm saying? They're all over that play. Can Warfield burn them? Oh, I tried to. I see you, Isaac. <laughs> we, we tried, fam. Wish we had Kalina for times like this. We would shine like this. We're going to go ahead and punt it away. It's actually a good punt. Conley is on. Oh, Conley gets uh, baptized. He gets straight up pancake, but not a good return. You see here, we have outgained them. We both have 13 uh, first downs. We only have one more play than them in almost 100 more yards than them. I think this is the time where they open up the offense just a little bit more and go to the air. But we'll, we'll, we'll see what they have in store for us. It is a pass. And he's wide open, overthrown. Coco, you got lucky. It's a draw. Can we make a tackle? Can we make a tackle? Can we make a tackle before he gets seven yards? Damn, they just paid Todd Gurley all that money. <laughs> and release him the next year. Life comes at you fast, bro. Oh, we beat our man with corn, and he falls for Gibbons. Get out of here. Don't like that we're a nickel. We're more of a 3-4 three, a three, squad. Well, here we go. Abernathy working on his man. That's why I play out in zone, because I could have taken that away. In the backfield, fellas. Oh, we all get stood up. Make a tackle. Dang. Oh, so they keep running the ball, man. They know it's a lot of time left. They don't have to just start being pass happy. It is another run to Gibbons. 
We played the pass. Big time mistake, and he's just – it's like he wasn't even touched. He was he was unfazed by anything that just happened there. 49 minutes. I'm 49. 49. All right, here we go. Second and nine. I mean, second and six here. I don't know why I keep saying the number nine. Madly met in the backfield there on that play. So now I can say nine. Third and nine. Second two, – two for six on third down conversions today, bro. Yo, 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 low Cutler. <laughs> we just had to heave it down there, man, and, and, let, and let our playmakers make a play. It was a dot. It was a strike. But Cutler came back to the ball and did what he had to do. All right, so that's our 14th first down of the ball game. Now, pretty soon, we're going to be coming for those uh those timeouts, baby. Gutsy, good play by uh by by uh, Warfield, you know what I'm saying? Gutsy, dog. Like, he doesn't let all those picks he, throw last, he threw last season – uh, you know what I mean? Uh, deter him this year. All right, working on this clock just a little bit. Boom, get to the outside madly. Look at our receivers just getting straight up pancaked out there. <laughs> like, they just got straight up bullied. Three for seven on third down conversions today. This Hawaii defense is flying to the ball, though, fam. Boom, Warfield keeps it. Ball four. Get off me. What a run by Warfield. That was a strong run, baby. We are one timeout away. From escaping with yet another seven-point lead, dog. Let's go, fellas. Isaac Johnson gets the handoff. Oh, ooh, I tried to do something dirty there. All right, getting the first down here would effectively end the game. But we're not going to force the ball anywhere. Boom. Jason Harris. What a gutsy throw from Warfield. And that's going to all but end the ball game here. All right, boys, here we go. First and 10. Minute 43 left here in this ball game. Go ahead and audible out of this. Get the ball to Madley. All right, he goes down. Nothing hurt. This game at one point looked like it was going to be a blowout for us. Hawaii stayed in here and, you know what I mean, stayed true to themselves. All right, Spratly, get in the end zone. Put the icing on the cake. They just stopped him short. We got to go for it. You already know. We got to go for it here. I'm, I'm sad he didn't score. I don't know how he didn't score, honestly. We're going to hand off to Cutler. Boom. Cutler gets the handoff. He's in the end zone. And that's going to be the ball game, baby. You already know we got to put the extra disrespect on him when we're going up against our in-state rival. Let's go, fam. All right, boys. So a 14-point victory is your final score here. Trey Warfield went off 475 yards, three touchdowns, no picks. Rest of the team only 27 yards. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, the touchdowns that came from him. But in the end, you know what I'm saying? We were just too much. Warfield with his second straight game ball, throwing for nearly 500 yards here in this rivalry matchup. So you take a look at the scoring summary here. Absolute fireworks in the first half. But in the second half, it was a little more even killed. You know what I'm saying? We prevailed, got that W. Um, you know, we got extra disrespect from the fourth. We just had to put more points on the board just to let them know we're better than you. Going over Warfield stats again, again. <laughs> Going over Warfield stats again. 224 QBR, 224 QBR, 23 for 32, 462, three touchdowns, no picks, 71 completion percentage, sack once, but it was a smart sack that he took. Uh, Jacob Madley, seven for 22 in the touchdown. Shuffle got three for two in the touchdown. Cutler, one for one in the touchdown. Through the air, Mike Cutler, seven for 132, two, touch, two touchdowns. Seven for 206 for Shuffle got Johnson in the touchdown. Jason Harris, four for 69. Spratley, three for 50. Madley, two for five. Moving on to the defensive side of the ball, Paisley led us in tackles once again. Seven tackles, six solo. Uh, Bauer had five. LSR had three. Four, I mean, had four or three solo. He also had a sack. Another sack went to Gary Abernathy down the stretch. We didn't catch any picks, and I don't know if we dropped any picks. We did. Shane Bauer batted one away. But in the end, you know what I'm saying, we just got this W, dog. So we're 2-0 to start off the year for the first time ever. We're undefeated. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, man. If you did, stop and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy, Uncle Sam's Reject, RKGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace. Letting you go. I was just letting you know. I know the weather is cold, but you on your own. I ain't no regular Joe. You shouldn't left me alone. I'm in the zone. I'm where the predators roam. We at the Senate in Rome, and I'm on the throne. This ain't no regular poem. This ain't that regular tone. No. Do you follow me?